Hey everybody, so this is my friend Jake. You may know him best by It's Jacob James on Instagram. He's, uh, he's my number one heckler. So I thought we should read other people's comments and uh, cause I've seen some hilarious things. So many people have said I live for the whispers. Puzzle, what is popping? That's like, yeah, I didn't yeah. think that was gonna be like, I don't know, I thought it was a dumb kind of stupid little thing that I did one time, but then, I don't know, you guys really, really liked it. So many comments, just comment and I oop. <laughs> that one, I really, I wish I remembered which one was the, you look like a pigeon. <laughs> Cause that one's just, it's gotta be on, I think it's on YouTube. I think it's gotta be on the one. Oh, was it like on the, the Q and A? Q &A? I think it might've been, it was either the Q and A or the, Q &A or the, or the reaction viral, The thing? viral one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do I look like Elijah Wood? I never thought you'd, or Daniel Radcliffe, that's another one. Well, that one I've gotten since I was younger. Really? Yeah, but actually- I never the, thought of that. But the one I've gotten the most since I was like little is uh, Tobey Maguire, Spider-Man. But that's the only one that I've ever seen myself, like that I've ever actually thought made any sense. Yeah, I can see that. One of my favorite parts about comments is like when people have a really well or, or, or very seriously stated opinion about something. Mm. And it's just like, cause here's what Uncle Barkley says, in my opinion, this is the best cover that he has done. <laughs> and I'm like, thank you, sir. I appreciate it. Like he's not laughing at all. <laughs> he's just like, this is the best one. <laughs> I gotta hand it to you guys though, because it, you, there are so many memes and vines in here. A lot of them I have seen, but there's a lot of ones that I have not seen that everybody recommends. And uh, that's super helpful to me. So never stop recommending things that you wanna see me do, because that's like, that helps feed, you know, the next thing. And I do read, I do read them. I read comments and I do read DMs even though I don't get a chance to reply to everything because that would just take an insane amount of time. But that is super helpful when people do that. So thank you for suggesting things and also expanding my meme horizons because <laughs> there's some really, really great stuff that people have turned me on to. Everybody's always talking about the clock and the oven and it's shutter speed, it's camera shutter speed. So I shoot on a Sony a6500 and I, I got that camera specifically because of how good all of the auto settings are. And for what I'm doing, like if I was gonna do more cinematic stuff and really kind of dive into the film process of it, then I would probably focus a lot more on the settings. But for this type of thing, man, if I can throw it on auto and know that it's gonna be in focus, it's gonna look good, like, that's all I care about. So therefore it sets the shutter speed on its own. And if the light is just right coming in, in the window, then I don't know, man. It's just the, the way it reacts with the LEDs. It's But I prefer this just being stuck in a time loop. <laughs> just, just dying says, how longer, how, <laughs> how longer till you get 1 million? And the answer is tomorrow, oop. <laughs> the profile picture matches the comments pretty well too. <laughs> These videos are great and all, but it makes me sad that not many people watch your other content. I'm assuming Vorsky that you mean like my, my like original music. That's, that is much appreciated. I sincerely appreciate that you have noticed that. Um, there's not a lot of it. I mean, you know, in terms of like serious content, but it's there and uh, anytime anybody checks that out, thank you. That's that's very nice of you. I love when people say this, I can tell this channel's about to blow. Right. Or like, the, I, I can tell this is about to go viral. It's like, dude, I went from 50 to 100,000 subscribers in like, a week and a half. Yeah, I mean, I'm I don't, I don't know what else I could do to, <laughs> to blow. Ooh, what if you made me think you could stop at five or six doors uh, or yeah. just one? I actually, I downloaded that video. It's in the mm, queue. What? I'm gonna sing Cher Lloyd by Cher Lloyd. What is that? That's from the video. Did you watch the video? Wait, which one is this? Which one are we looking at? We're again? looking at disgusting. Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought we were looking at the most recent one. I left a comment, it was a rather vulgar comment on that <laughs> video on YouTube and it got removed within like five minutes. It was weird. What? Yeah. What did, what did you say? I don't, I don't wanna repeat it. Well, I said, when, when you nut and she keeps sucking. <laughs> <laughs> and that got removed? It got removed within like five minutes. <laughs> oh my God. I didn't remove it. That was like it. the perfect comment for that video. I know, but I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> don't you know, I only make G-rated content. That's right, yeah. Please, sir, make a piano cover of Not the Yadas. So, okay, here's, the, I don't, I don't know why everybody wants, like, it's, it's already done. It's done. Yeah, yeah. It's, <laughs> that, that's the version. It's, look what she did to my man shit, though. She cut my man shit off. And it's a great version. I don't know 
uh, who did it, but like, it's, it's amazing. It's, and I don't know what else, I don't know what I, what else I would do with it, but I appreciate yeah. that people want it. Actually, this one's funny only because of the way it's worded. What's that? This is on the <laughs> Tyler one video and says, when you try to hold a toot in, <laughs> when you try to hold a toot in while in the company of family, it's just like, it's not that funny, but like the way it's worded. The, the toot, it's like the use of the word toot, toot. And while in the company of family. <laughs> it's very, very, very properly very worded. Very proper. <laughs> What is this? I wonder how good you'll sound if you do ASMR. Yeah, that, that should be your next thing. What did, what did that have to do with the video? <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna do ASMR, but I'll update you if that does happen. An ASMR dub would be interesting though. Yeah, but you can't, you can't dub whisper. Fun fact, I can't dub a whisper. There's no, Notes. you're not producing any vibration with your vocal cords. There's no pitch. It's just, yeah, you know, that's a good point. It'd be a good challenge, though. Yeah, there's no challenge to be done. I think it, it's impossible. But you can, if anyone can do it, it's Charles <laughs> Cornell. I liked this one. It's one of those spam comments on Instagram. Come check out my page. I post funny memes. You won't regret it. <laughs> and then Model Dad says, "I checked it out and immediately regretted it." <laughs> <laughs> I finally found your damn account after three months <laughs> since nobody credits you in reposts. <laughs> Three, mo three months. You've three been looking months. for him. I've been looking for him for three months. I've only been doing this for three <laughs> weeks, but I appreciate you seeking me out. What the I love these totally like someone's talking to themselves types of comments where it's like, but <laughs> son, I mean, this shit is fucking genius. What do you expect, bro? <laughs> like he's just talking to somebody, but he's just like typing while he's talking to him. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. Oh, I love it when people say totally unironically, like, oh, I've been here since like, I've been here since 6K subscribers, yeah. and I'm like, you've been here since last week. <laughs> <laughs> I left a comment in response to somebody the other day who was like, I've been following you since like, what is some number? Some 50, like 50, 50K. <laughs> I've been following you. <laughs> <laughs> yesterday. Yeah, since I've been following you since yesterday. <laughs> 10K gang, where you at? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. Oh, Rhett. Yeah, I this is one, one. Yeah. you know, and, and I'm, I'm fans of Rhett and Link. I've watched their stuff for a long time. And you know, the first video I saw of theirs was the Taco Bell drive through one. And I know they were making content long before that, but that, that was like, I remember watching that video and I was like, this is brilliant. Mm. Yeah. You know what I mean? But I never in my life thought that I looked anything like him. I didn't either. So I think it must funny. just be the fact that I have a beard, although his kicks my beard's ass <laughs> by far. And uh, we have like a similar kind of hair thing going on. I guess, yeah, I don't know. It's so funny like seeing what other people think that you, like who you look like. Yeah. Because right? yeah, yeah, yeah. I just never thought about that. I never would have thought that, yeah. This is on the global warming video on Instagram. It says, you getting laid for this raw fucking talent yet or what? <laughs> <laughs> the person who made the, that one beat, like the, I don't know. Yeah, I don't yeah, know yeah, it's yeah, like yeah. A, it's like no, a no. lo-fi page okay. or something. Uh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna put it like right here. But that was like, dude, I saw yeah. that on Twitter. Yeah, dude, I was jamming that like unironically, just chilling in my house. So the other day. good, so good. I see, I see some stuff sometimes where where, there, where somebody's like, this guy's all over my feed, and it's annoying. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, sorry. Man. There is true though. There's sometimes when I'm scrolling through YouTube, and every time I scroll through, there's this one creator. <laughs> every I hit not interested every time, <laughs> and it still pops up, and I'm like, what do I have to do? <laughs> To get you out it's of my life. YouTube, man. It's not me. If my videos are showing up and you're recommended, I'm, so, I'm sorry if you don't want them there, but I have nothing to do with that. Here's one on the uh, God and Anime one on Instagram. He has not left his bench in two weeks. <laughs> kind of true. It's true. People always ask for sheet music. I don't have any sheet music. I don't write sheet music. I have no idea how you would notate any of this. Uh, so I, I can't help you there. I don't know, maybe one day I'll, I'll, I'll figure out how to make music to something, but... <laughs> how the heck did I get here from pimple popping videos? <laughs> oh no. By the way, the Bill Wirtz references are blowing my mind. That dude is one of the most talented people I've ever seen online. And the fact that people think that anything I'm doing is remotely like his, Wow, that's really cool, and I appreciate that a lot, because Bill is the man. I didn't even realize that he said, uh, I'm gonna stab him. 
because it was so, so violently Canadian the way he said it. <laughs> that I thought, I thought, I almost thought he was saying stop for a second because I wasn't really I listening. Was. I was only listening for pitch. And then, and then I saw the comments about, about him pulling a knife and I was like, oh, <laughs> I never even saw it. You're gonna look at me and you're gonna tell me. As I was making it, that's hilarious. I wish, there's two comments that, I've, that we've gotten that, that I wish I could find and I can't. <laughs> Somebody commented on my Amazing Grace cover and they were like, not funny. <laughs> And then somebody commented back and just said, no shit, Sherlock. <laughs> Tara Stark says, can you post this on Twitter so I can retweet? Yes, I can. And I did already. Follow me on Twitter. <laughs> oh, everybody's been commenting, saying stuff about Seth Everman. That yeah. dude is awesome. And I would love to do something with him. Mm. Just like the deadpan musical humor is just yeah. absolute gold. <laughs> drama kids. I don't understand why people get so upset over sports. Also drama kids. <laughs>